As you can see, this Mavic 2 really took a hard landing on a crash. Snapped the landing gear off. Uh, but the arm's fine. So what I've done, so I don't have to replace the whole arm, is I bought this arm, and I'm going to steal this from it. The landing gear, take it all off. I'm going to show you how to do that. Okay, so here's the new arm. Plastic coating off. I'm going to use this little screwdriver. I'm going to pop this out. Okay, now that I have that off, there's a screw right here, very small screw, and what I'm using here is my RC toolkit, which has just about most of the things you need to take something small like this apart. Okay. Now you're going to take these take these loose. I'll leave a description down below. I'll leave a link in the description down below on where you can get these arms. I think I got this one for like $37 with free shipping, which isn't bad. Okay. All right. So now I've gotten that out. You'll see this is glued down in here. I'll just pull this out. Be gentle with the wires. There we go. So I've gotten that loose. And in order to get let me pull this out first. This is the antenna right here. There we go. The antenna's out. And in order to get this LED out without messing it up, I'm going to have to pull pull the LED LED out just enough to get back in there. You see that? And I'm gonna take a Dremel tool and I'm gonna widen that out just a bit so I can slide it through there. All right. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go ahead and Dremel this. I'll let you watch me Dremel it. But I'm going to turn the sound off so you don't have to hear the Dremel tool. Okay, you can see I've drilled a small hole in my Dremel tool right there. just need to make sure you pull this upwards so you don't catch one of the wires. So you'll slide this down. There we go. I got it through there. Bam. Then you have your piece that you need. There you go. Okay. Since this one's already exposed, I don't have to pull the cover off. I can just unscrew this screw. I got very lucky it didn't break the arm on this. There we go.
what I'm pretty much doing is going through the same process I did on the new arm. It's just this is on the old arm. Wow, look at that. That is crazy. Got dirt all jammed up in there. Alright, let me stop and clean this out. And I'll finish. Alright there. Oh, this one just came straight out. I didn't have to... Dremel that one. Okay, so I'm going to slide the LED back in, which just can be a little frustrating sometimes. Just want to make sure you have it on the right way. So you slide it in here. If you make the hole big enough, it should come through pretty easy. But you don't want to make it too big because you want to have a snug fit. There we go, the LED's in. And now I will put in the antenna. Then we just bolt it right back together. Okay, the last screw in the side here. And then all we have to do is pop our cover on. Okay. Four pins line up just like this. Push it back in. You'll hear it snap. There we go. done and it'll probably take you the same amount of time it took me it's not really that hard it's just a little tedious uh, the main key is getting that hole big enough in this landing gear to slide the LED through like I said I'll put a link in the description below uh, for the arms on eBay uh, appreciate you watching I hope this helps somebody